Now in this video I'm going to show you how to change the backlight color of the mentioned SDC6203 car power adapter. Right. Now first you have to press this button. Keep it pressed and then insert the input immediately you will see the LCD select which shows uh, it is ready for selection of the backlight color now every time you, you give it a quick push here it change color right it has about five or six different colors to meet your taste okay now see right this is uh, neutral green red blue purple okay right all right I'll stay in this color all right I select this color so what you do take it out and reinsert again wow okay this is the color you select now the next thing I'm going to demonstrate is to show you uh, the input voltage actually this is a measurement of your battery voltage which is quite accurate actually uh, uh, it has uh, on top of the actual digital display of the actual voltage it also gives you uh, a rough idea about your battery condition say and when you see the display and that means it is between 11.5 to 13 volt right and if you see it uh, okay let's increase the battery voltage all right from to about uh, 13 volt a little bit higher okay right from one of higher that means your battery voltage is quite good and it's high right so if I decrease the battery voltage look right now once it go down be lower than 13 volt then it becomes normal what we call normal and if I decrease the battery voltage from normal down to let's say uh, 11.5 right now I decrease it slowly 11.9 all the way 11.7 11.6 11.5 still okay and 11.4 less than I put it back again right as you can see as soon as it's approaching 11.5 is low what we call low battery condition and you can see right the backlight is sort of flashing which is really low, too low for, for a car battery okay put it up again right 11.6 it becomes normal so that means L the low battery condition uh, starts with 11.5 alright sometimes it just freaks sometimes it's not now what happens uh, there's another function about this uh, this uh, 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 this adapter is it also protects your battery from over discharge okay before we go to that let's go to this part the output current in the output current uh, I'll do uh, uh, let me get this right now 
the output current discharge this this window source the output current uh, let's make it back to no here 11.6 11.7 let's make it back to normal okay 11 12 12 12.2 or 12.5 what what whatever all right and uh, we use this high power USB output socket okay plug it in okay and I'm going to charge my iPad the iPad is taking this video right you can see there are four one two three four four chart four bar okay now what does it mean by four bar here I have a tape I have written out here one bar means is the output current is about 0.2 of an amp to 0.7 of an amp it's, it's just a very rough indication you know okay it's within this range 2 bar means it's 0.7 to 1.2 amp alright it, it's not that uh, uh, and then 3 bar means it's 1.2 to 1.7 amp now 1 point uh, 4 bar means it's 1.7 amp to 2.2 M. That means this car power adapter is supplying anywhere between 1.7 to 2.2 amp to my iPad, to my Apple iPad. Okay, so uh, well, it got plenty of power here uh, because it can go all the way up to 6 bar. Right. Okay. So this is uh, uh, the meaning of the bar chart in the output current. The meaning of the bar chart in the output current. Okay. Now let's go back to the voltage. Uh, as you can see, right, there's a voltage drop because uh, of uh, the supplier the supplying current for a battery is 12.4 uh, volt okay but the edge because of the consumption of the output low so it drops to 11.6 right uh, okay uh, now let's reduce the voltage as you can see right uh, this is already 11.4 which is now you guys It's drawing too much current from the car battery, so it flickers. All right, because here it registered eleven point four. Now, if I go further down, your car battery is. 12.1 okay and because of the high current is drawing now further down further down now your car battery is 11.9 and you can see flashing red light uh, which is 
Okay, if I still go further down. All right, as you can see, what happened? There's no more output low. That means it cut off the output altogether. It just cut off the output altogether. This way, it protects your car battery from over-discharging.